Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to episode 28 of Rustic Waters 2. And um, in the last episode, I started on um, the pump jack and then had to try and work out how on earth I was going to um, to power it because I was thinking about using something like a magmatic dynamo, some kind of dynamo but they all seem to be nerfed from the pack. So at least you can't craft it. Um, I say that because um, I went and solved the problem after I, you know, after I'd gone and recorded the video. So I will show you that in a second. I also went dungeoneering last night. I didn't plan to, but then I forgot I had the explosion, um, uh spell in my spell book and it was the most fun thing ever <laughs> going through dungeons and exploding them quite it was quite good so all of these crates all these um these chests are all full of stuff and i've got lots of um lots of machines not as many as yorkshire panda because you know we have this rivalry going on with the machines not as much as him but you know, got lots of machines, um, lots of stuff. There's money, there's upgrades, there's food, um, uh, these things, lots of um, weapons. And actually, he I have to thank him. He pointed something out to me. Um, some of these things can be um, recycled. It's not called a recycler. It's called something else. I forget what it's called. Um, but you can recycle them and get back the stuff. So a lot of his, a lot of his um, weapons, I'm just taking some out so we can try and do it in a second. A lot of the weapons, what he, when he gets them, what he will do. Do I have a full set? I might have a full set of Atem, Atem stuff. Now that I'm looking at it. But um, yeah, what he does, and I got an elytra. That was the most awesome thing. So yeah, but what he does, he will um take the weapons and he will recycle them and you pretty much get back one for one what you've done. So, oh, netherite quarter stuff. But I could do it with the netherite. So, um, so yes, yeah, so I got loads of things. You know, like I said, just looking at all this stuff. Got a lot of coins. I'm sure there's more. A lot of snowballs. Because when you explode things, it just, it takes out everything. There's the legs. There's the eyes. Didn't I get something else of Atem the other day? I'm sure I did. I'll have to go look and see. Or maybe it was this. Maybe it was this. It's the halo of Ra. I'm sure I got something else, like the feet of Atem or something. Let me have a quick look now that I've reminded myself. Yes. Feet. I've got feet, I've got legs, and I've got eyes. We just need the chest, please. And we're good. And I'm sure that will turn up somewhere. So, um, yeah, so that was that. Also, now that I'm over here, um, I did say that I'd upgraded my backpack. I have the, um, the epic backpack, not the epic, is it epic? Um, I can't remember which tier it is, but I have like the second to second to best tier, second best tier. And, um, yeah, the epic backpack. Then I was looking at the ultimate backpack and you need enderium cloth for that. And that is enderium blend and linen. And the enderium blend is just lead, diamond and enderpearl dust. And basically you just, you know, stick them in the, in a, in a pulverizer and you get it. That's enrichment chamber or crusher. I had lead dust in. No, I put it in the pulverizer and it worked. So I made those. 
I made the cloth, put my epic backpack in there, and now I have the ultimate backpack. Yeah, that is a backpack. So um, I'll put that on in a second. Let's just put that out of the way. This is something that I got um, one of the loot loot things. And you put it on your feet. It gives you plus 25 swimming speed and twice the air supply. And you can put it on your feet. I also got these as well, digging claws and feral claws. So the digging claws um, increases your mining speed and base mining level. And the feral claws um, increases your attacks, attack speed is nice. And let's put these on my feet. So hopefully it will make me swim faster. Um, right, so let's go up. We need to go up anyway. No, before we go up, let's go. Let's go down. Let me show you what I did with um our our pump jack i made a room for it i put in glass i used the exchanger and put in glass it's not perfect i kind of messed up on that side but i'll go and fix it at some point and what i did it's, it's not working right now because this ender tank is full but what i did was that um I made a, a windmill, just like we have upstairs, put in a belt, put in the gearbox, put in the rotational controller, and then turn the speed to 120, 128. So that was fast enough for the alternator to get power and also not to overstress the unit. Then. Um, I have um, the power go from the alternator to an LV capacitor and because first of all I thought the power the, way, the reason why I set it up this way I thought the power was coming here but it's not then I realized oh I could have put it here okay never mind next I'll, I'll change it but then I realized that um no that's output Where's the power? The power. Ow, 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 ow. Power's here. Right? So, um, yeah. For some reason, I thought it was here. And then I realized it's not here. It's there. So, um, that's why I've got this kind of dire wiry, very convoluted kind of thing. But this is full. But when it was working, it was pumping up and down. Right? Yeah. <sighs> So that's that. So the next thing is the mixer. We have to do that. And where is the uncrafter? So you get back the pole and you get back the iron, but then the pole, I think you can put it back in and you get linen cloth and treated sticks. So that is extremely cool. So you get back quite a lot. Of, you, you, you literally get back whatever you put in. Right. So I am enjoying, you know, I got now I've got to sort out all my armor. And render it all down, uncraft it. Into um, into its base components. So that's something which is brilliant. So I've got to spend time doing that as well. But um, so yeah, so there is that. So yeah, what do I uh pull? Yeah. So the mixer, I want to put it up here. So I'll have all my power generation up here and downstairs I'm going to take apart the crusher because we don't need this anymore we don't need this and I will put all the machines down here so we have a production area down here and power upstairs 
so let's see i want that i want oh i need to put my backpack on before i forget her body back i would never get fed up looking at that right so the mixer is here and um when you have the items in your hand it will show you where to put it okay so this is that's got to be the next level that's the next level oh no there and mm -hmm. that is a yeah now it's showing me the next level all right let's take you off because you're not needed take you off i think that's needed so that is on this side you can see it's highlighted so you know where it's supposed to go um sheet metal oh what was that light engineering is this light engineering yes light engineering block goes here and here you have to i mean i'm not a huge fan of um of immersive engineering but they are when it comes to um making their machines they're very good at letting you know what you need to do okay so we need the light engineering on the top and what else you need that no just the light engineering and is that another oh that's the fence i'm not sure what fence that is though let's go have a look because we had to make it as part of the quest line maybe it's steel fence it might be steel fence let me get a steel fence or um treated wood fence let's see what fence we have first of all okay we have alu aluminium but that's just forge fences do we have any steel fence we don't but i can make some all right uh steel s-t-e okay no want to go there right let's uh should i make treat let's make treated wood as well just in case um the treated mm -hmm. sticks and planks did i put them in a separate thing you know what happened as well i ran out of storage space i had to put more chests in front here because i was totally full up didn't expect that at all uh treated wood fence what are we missing didn't i get two? Oh, i only got two i need four uh treated wood fence there you go we've got both types So it should be one or the other because I mean it's immersive and usually it's either treated woods or steel. Is that highlighted? Yes it is. All right so now oh we need the yeah because now that's showing that it's ready to be built we need the engineer's hammer 
And is that in my toolbox? I hope it is. No. No, it's not. <laughs> it was, and then I took it out to make um to make <laughs> to make sheet metal, and I totally forgot, so I didn't have to come downstairs. No. There you go. So that is the mixer. Okay, why is it now showing red? That I don't understand why it's... Is it showing that it's built? Because usually red is something bad. Okay, I don't know why it's showing like this. Um, but we need to put in... Okay, output only bottom fluid what oh that says inventory that's empty and that's that needs power so where do we put Oh, okay. Display all fluids. Output only bottom fluid. Display all fluid. Output all fluids. Okay, I guess you'd put it like that. Let's go and get our um our our ender tank. I don't know why this keeps showing up as red. It's kind of bugging me. I'm worried. All right, this is input. Um, ender tank. There's our ender tank. Um, yeah, blue is output. I think we need a switch here. This is output. Okay, this is going to be going into a tank. Oh, you know what I was supposed to do? I was supposed to make, you remember back a while back, they had that dots thing. Um, oh, 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 create crafting, yes, factory, you had to make factory dots, and I never put it up, I want to, I want to pump the oil into that. And it said you can use glass. Any factory block from chisel can be used in the frame along with framed glass. Okay. Um, all right. I have some framed glass because I had to make. I had to make some for the thing downstairs where the pump jack is housed. All right, I have to know, let me see. The input is there. If I put the, it's there. Where's our dots? Okay, if we put glass here and here, at least we can see into it.
Gonna have to make some more. Gonna have to, I'm gonna have to make some more. Right, I'll be back in a second. Okay, um, uh, All right, how do I... You know what? I don't know how you connect to these things. But how do you... Oh, tank valve. There you go. Or is that each tank must have at least one fluid valve for importing and exporting? All right, let's. I knew this was going to come in useful at some point. V A L V. V, it helps when you can spell. I keep saying that to myself. Oh no, I shouldn't have put those in. I probably needed those. Um, dots. Yeah, helps when you can spell. It's, you know, that's one of the good things about life. When you can spell, you can get, you can do lots of things. All right, so if this is where the input is, um, tank valve, blacklisted block, found at 34, 22, 34, 13. Seven. Is that up there? Where's thirteen? Oh, oh, no. Twenty four. Is that it? Oh, it might be. It doesn't like the glass in the sides. It might be. It doesn't like the glass in the sides. Okay. Take those out. Thirty-four twenty. Yeah. Oh, so, oh, okay. Twenty four thirteen. Where's twenty four thirteen? That's twenty three thirteen. Ah. Up here. Is that what it's talking about? 34, 22, 13. 34. 34. Thirty-four twenty. Is wait a minute. Is it this one? Maybe it's this one. All right, hold on. It might be that it didn't like the the input tank. Um. So where can we put input? Oh, okay. 
not on the bottom. I might have to make this bigger. Right, let's go make some more of these then. I I severely underestimated what I was gonna do. Right, let's take you off. And we need steel and clay. Right? I mean you wouldn't think I've just done it what how many times? Right, steel and clay. And clay. Okay, that should be big enough for anything. And we got framed glass. Scaffolding, scaffolding. Sorry, I, sorry for spinning around like that. Uh... I would have sorted all of these last night, but then it was like, oh, you know what? I think it's out here. But then I just wanted to show you, even me with my with my rubbish capabilities, I managed to get that done. I don't know where I put my scaffold in. Yeah, I don't know where the scaffold in is. I am just um, I just jumped on top. And I'm just building. So let's take out this bit in the middle. And let's see how high we can go with this. A um, little bit more. One more level. And then I can take these out, put in the framed glass, and then take this out and put that in. What? 3422. It's down there. Thirty four twenty two thirteen. No, that's oh, you know what? Because I haven't put in a base. Oh, my days, I am such a doofus. Yes. There you go. That means then I pro uh no, probably couldn't have put it there. Um we need oh this is too close. Cause I was thinking it would just go from there to there. <sighs> Alright, this needs to go over one block. It needs to go over a block. Alright, let me Take it apart. We'll do this again. I'll just put it on double speed. Or I can just wave my magic wand. And by the power of YouTube, it will be up again. Right, so that is... Um, that's done. So that's going to connect from there to there. And we need another um we need another input tank valve because that's going to be output as empty but we also need one for input so that's going to be on the side here let's go make another tank valve okay if we put it here okay part of a tank and and the tank
this feeling. Can I see how much is in there? There's something in there. And let's go down and see if we're pumping. Yes. Nice. So that is pumping, as you can see. And yes, that's going up slowly. Going up slowly. Excellent. And then we can put this in here. But how does the mixer work? Immersive engineering has a book, doesn't it? It has a manual. Did we make it? Um, engineer's manual. You need a, a lever and a book. I can't remember if we made it or if it was given to us or what. Let's have a look over here first. No, that's the planes one. Yes, we did have it. All right, um, heavy machine. Oh, oil processing. Pump jack. All right, well, the pump jack we've done. Um, the mixer. Tool, simple machines. No, does it have an index? Heavy machinery? There you go. Uh, dissolve solids in fluids, mixing them together. The structure is built as shown and is formed by using the engineer hammer on the central sheet metal block. And it's for mixing fluid concrete from water. And fluids are input into the mixer through the port at the bottom of the power supply. And items can be input via the two hatches at the back and the fluid port at the the fluid port at the front serves as the fluid output. Okay. But it doesn't actually tell us what we can put in it. Is it in the storyline, the quest book? Because that's one thing I keep forgetting to actually read the quest book. Because, um,. It does tell you what you need to do. Your mixer will need initial FE to begin processing. This can be provided by your create alternator. And once you pre begin producing ethanol, you will not need your alternator set up again. All right, so how do we produce ethanol? E ethan ethanol. Okay, so we need bitumen and corn and crude oil, and that gives you ethanol. Okay, so bitumen, bitumen, and you get that from bitumen sand. Okay. That now makes sense. The multi servo press, that's the block of bitumen. Block of bitumen. Okay, so the centrifugal separator. All right, so we should have had this, and it also produces crude oil as well. All right, so that means then I should have had this going. That's why it wanted you to get bitumen sand. But it didn't totally explain why. Okay. All right, so let's get, I have been collecting it because I knew I'd need it. So let's go get some, because I want this, I want this producing and then we can get into the nitty gritty. We can, I can start making the turbine and then I'm going to have to go and really farm some stuff. All right, centrifugal separator, here it is. 
Oh, this is going slow. Um, I'm sure I have an. Do I have an augment that would have that would help? Uh, I should have looked that up before. Then I would have known. I would have known. Okay, so what's the back and what's the front? So that's output. I said the front and the back. Oh, input. And that's no. Red is input, blue is output, right? Um, uh, which ones are color coordinated? I can't remember. Input is blue, output is orange, right? Input is blue. Okay, so maybe this is where we output stuff. I've got it the wrong way around. <laughs> oh my days. This is this is annoying now. Have I got this the wrong way around? So this is where you input items. And this is where you imp I've got it the wrong way around. But at this point I'm not that bothered. All right, where do we input? That's a... Uh, where do we put the... Oh, that's where the power goes in. All right, that's an LV connector. Pretty sure I can just use energy pipes. See? Immersive engineering for noobs. This is what we're doing. Oh, oh, okay. Um, I was just there thinking, why am I going so slow? Yeah, this doesn't have an auto feeder. I keep forgetting. At least I don't think it does. No. Oh, I found night vision. That was one of the books I got. I was very happy with that. But I haven't made an auto feeder yet for my... Because this is going to be my... um my stuff from now on um energy pipes all right i've got two um how do you make redstone and nickel i will make this pretty i promise yep it's getting our Okay, that, that's probably not enough. Um, oh, does it need a lever? Or does... Oh, it might need something to output the fluid into the gas. Ethanol. Ethanol is... It's a fluid? It's a fluid. So, um, that's output. That's input. Output is orange. All right, let me make another ender tank. Wait a minute, it doesn't have any crude oil in it, does it? No, it doesn't have any crude oil. Because we need to put it in. <sighs> See, that's what happens when you don't know what you're doing. I'm not... I keep saying I'm not mechanically minded, although I'm not really sure that's much of a... of a thing. But these things just don't come naturally to me. Fluid. Three of those. We need more of you. That's what going to be nickel and what? Or maybe we need the fluid pipes. I don't know. Um, nickel and slime.
And do I have my wrench? I do now. Okay, I am determined to have this thing working. Bring you around this way. Oh, you don't like that. Okay, you don't like that. What kind of pipes can you use? All right, if I take you from there, um, and, and, the, and the tank, and I put you here, are you filling up? No. No. You're filling. All right, I know mechanism pipes work with. Or maybe I should just have, um. I should just use immersive engineering pipes. All right, are you? No, you're no longer. Yeah, you're now filling. All right, so um, immersive engineering have have fluid pipes, but these pipes don't work. Take you off. Mechanism fluid pipes. Oh crap! Did I lose? Oh, I thought I lost the oil that was in there. I was about to get very upset. All right, mechanism fluid pipes. What do I need to make those? Because I'm pretty sure they work. Or we could try the immersive engineering ones because those are cheaper. Um, did I drop them back in? I did. All right, let's make some more then. Um, I need iron. I have sheets, I do. And I've got one there. Can I mix and match the sheets, I wonder? No, iron plates. Can I mix and match these plates? Uh, engineer's hammer. Five, seven, seven, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Get one extra just in case we can't mix and match. Right. Um, so. Oh, you can. Nice. Oh, you haven't. Oh, you don't like that either. Maybe because it's on the side? Or is that just, um. Oh, you know what? This is probably input for. Well, when you don't know, you don't know. When you don't know, you don't know. All right, and then... Yes, now that's filling up. But are you... Okay, bitumen. Go recipes. All right, so what? 
But I need another tank for this to be output into. Because it's not. Alright, we're going to need another tank. Um... So that's now full of ethanol. Output bottom fluid. There you go. That should be filling? No? Okay, why are you not... Um... That's going in. Alright, why is this not working? Output only bottom fluid, which is this. But this is empty. Why are you not? Do I need redstone signal, maybe? Come on. I want to get this working, then we can, then next episode, I can do the gas turbine. And then we would be up and running. I need cobble and a stick. Cobble. Okay, let me make a, um, I might have to do it this way as well. Take it out via ender tank. Hmm. All right, so to get the ender tank, that means I've got to go kill some endermen. Endermen? No. Blaze. Got to kill Blaze. Oh, my days. See, I've come out here to kill Blazes. And these things are also trying to kill me. I'm trying to hit it with the with my killing spell because then um I can get whatever oh my god not even not even Ugh. Right, let's go a little bit further. Because then if I hit it with the spell, it will pick up the, um, it will pick up the membrane for me. Right, got both of those. Did I get any membranes? What the fudge? Who else? There's two more. Oh, God. There's three more. I came out here to kill blazes, not to kill these things. Right, we got you. We get all of you? Yes, according to the mini map we have. Onto the mini map I have, and I have four membranes. Awesome. Right now for you, 
I wanted to go in with my um, my looting sword. Yeah, man. And that hasn't made any difference. Okay. I just have like looting, looting some foolishness. Uh, looting three. That's supposed to be the good one. Oh, I need to eat. Eat. Yeah. Need to eat. But at least we've got membranes, which is pretty cool. Oh, we got a, oh, we got a big one. Oh, we killed it. And we got books. And we got a, a core drop as well. Respirate. Oh, nice. Respiration 3, block reach. What? Oh, go away. Uh, where are you? Can't see you. Oh! Stupid thing. Uh, not in the water. Right, you're gone. I'm still in the water. Uh, we didn't get any membranes from that though. I would use the explode spell on them, but that will also get rid of the um the spawner. Okay, we need two more blaze rods, because we need four per. We need two more blaze rods. And then we good. Alright, one more. See, this has better looting. I'm, I'm pretty sure there's a fortune enchantment. <sighs> Got you as well. And are you going to bring me any? No, you're not. Come on, before the sun comes up. I've got a membrane from you. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I want one more. One more. That's all. Really? Just one. Yeah, the explode thing um, will get rid of the spawners. So we don't need that. Right, there's no more. Come on, the sun, the sun will be coming up soon. I just want one more. Yes, thank you. Um, back. There you go. And it just started raining. Which probably would have been good because blazes don't like rain. You know who I haven't seen for a while? Cujo. Or did I put him to sit down? I think I might put him to sit down someplace. Which is probably why I haven't seen him. Um, yes. Uh, no. We want to make... Wanted to make two blaze... Two ender tanks. Alright. Uh, wool, obsidian, blaze rods. Okay, right. So we've got the two ender tanks... All right, that's still full of ethanol. Take you off. All right, we need to change. Ethanol is, let's see what dye we have. Because if I keep it as black, it's going to fill up with crude oil.
do we have we have gray and light gray okay so put you both down and change it to black gray black and now that should be empty okay so that filling I can't tell doesn't look like it though yeah that's going up slowly nope not doing anything I don't know what I'm doing wrong what is oh what is this is that the input output no that's not doing anything yeah you can't put anything on that either um okay the only other thing i can think of is using the immersive pipes because that might be uh what are you doing oh is it supposed to be like that i don't know but that might be what the problem is Okay, um, we don't want you to connect with that. Okay, I'm still saying zero. Output bottom only fluid. That's not it, what's wrong? Um, I don't know. All fluids? No, I'm still not doing anything. And the lever only stops it from working. It's not going to stop. It stops the machine from working, but it's not going to stop the ethanol from coming out. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Maybe it's the tank. Maybe it's not big enough. It says the tank is valid. But maybe the tank's not big enough. Let me rebuild it. Okay. Um, I use a different pipe. And it's going in. Because I use an immersive pipe. I thought maybe... It doesn't like the fluid pipes going from the immersive machine, so that's fine. That seems to be working. And it's going in the ender tank, but the ender tank doesn't want to go here. And I'm now wondering if I can't use this for the ethanol. So it could be that I'm not, that I. It could be that it it doesn't this tank doesn't work. But it, are those bubbles coming out? <laughs> oh, that's quite funny. All right, so um, immersive has um storage, storage, storage um fluid containers, the sheet metal containers, I think. Yes metal barrels and I think you can use that to store you can use it to store um, fluid this should still have this has lots of ethanol okay so that's everything in there turn that on and that should work? I don't understand. I don't know what's going on. 
Or is it just... Oh, you know what? Um, is there any way... Oh, okay. So it is working. It is working. And if I make another barrel... Uh... All right, if I make another barrel, is that going to... I don't know what that's going to do. Actually, no. Let's not worry about that. Let's... I want to get this over and done with. I want the turbine done, so this is going to be a longer episode. But I want the turbine. I want the... I want that done. So... Let me get all of that ready back in a sec. Okay, right. So for the turbine, um, so we had to make the aluminite blend, which I've made. And then I made the conductive tubing and the conductive wiring. And you take the aluminite blend and smelt it and it gives you ingots. And then you use a stick to make the tubing and you put uh, copper wire, redstone wire around it and that gives you the conductive wiring. So I've done that. Um, gas turbine controller, reinforced wood, which we have mechanical AI chip. Need to buy an activated um, idol of sacrifice. Okay, so we have you. <sighs> I always get lost. I don't know why. I come down here and it's like, yeah, where am I going? This way. No, it's not that way. Okay, so... Um, AI chip. We need that. We need silver plates and we need redstone wire. Um, we need the silver plates. I really need to make the um thing that's make the stamps. Thing that's make the plates. Okay mechanical chip that is that and the gas turbine controller you possible modules all right i have no idea how we're going to put this together but you know difficulty heart i like that All right, fluid intake valve, we need one. You can install up to five, but you'll only require one intake for ethanol. Okay. Um, right, do I have, did I smelt up any more luminite? I don't think I did. Okay, so we've got the controller. We want the fluid intake valve. I have no idea what the difference is, but there you go. We want one. Uh, flux generator. Uh, power input output module all right so we need more redstone wire and we need some pistons right so that was that uh, input output missing two more aluminite we're making flux generator right there's that Basic power capacitor, 1 million FE, um, and we need a block of redstone. Um, I think the fuel tank, right, that needs pressure valves. Steel. Right, fuel tank needs three. Got enough for two. Why did it only give me two? Oh, because we need the extra conductive tubing. Okay, turbine blades. There's steel. We want 16, so we want four sets. Four by three is 12. 12 luminite and eight, eight steel. Oh no, we have enough. One, two, three. 
four. Right. And the turbine rotors. Um, two basic turbines. And we're missing conductive wiring. Okay, basic turbine. That's that. Fuel mixer. Two more pistons. Oh dear, this rabbit hole. Two more pistons. What are we missing? Need two more bits of cobble. Nope, I don't. Um, two bits of redstone, two bits of iron, um, just missing one of these. Right, air fuel mixer, is that it? We want two basic turbines. Okay. Um, there's the other basic turbine. Oh my days! That was that was a grind. All right. So this turbine. I mean, I have no idea how to put it. To, oh no! You know what? It's probably in the thing. Okay. Do we get any kind of book? No. Okay. Um advanced generators. Okay, please tell me you have some kind of book, sign, something, something, something. No? No. No book. I'm hoping this is easy to put together. Okay, once you have all those pieces crafted, you can form your multi-block in nearly any shape that you would like. Alright, so... Alright, let me take a picture on my phone, and then let's see, alright, picture taken, let's see if I can work out what goes where. They said any shape that you like, so they have an, a, it's not even an L shape, it's a duck shape. Alright, so they've got the power capacitor on one end. They've got um, something that got to be the fluid intake valve, flux generator. I think that's the flux generator next to it. Um, they have two basic turbines. Uh, next to it, that looks like that might be the fluid intake. Then they've got the turbine controller. Okay, that's formed. And what are we missing? And fuel tank and the fuel air mixer. Alright, let's... Oh, okay, so we've got two turbines. It's empty. Our peak production is two, 256 Fe per tick. Peak fuel consumption is, well, we don't know yet. Current production is nothing and current fuel consumption is nothing. 
input configure output configuration okay so that's empty that's got to be your ethanol okay well in that case we can set this up over here and somehow i don't think it has to be i mean i don't think you've got to put any oh hello um i don't think you have to uh flux generator where was the fluid fluid intake okay so i don't think okay i think you just need those components okay so they can't be in any any configuration okay right let's go back to the picture fluid intake two turbines okay i know it's not valid i'm here working it out um oh you know why it said it wasn't valid because probably because it didn't have the gas turbine on it there you go you need the turbine control if i just plop these down wherever yeah still valid okay all right i want these in like a cube okay that's freaky looking but it works and then if we want to we can expand it and so on and so on yeah i like this okay so fluid intake we need to get the ethanol in here fluid intake so do you work um oh my, uh let me go build one i'll be back okay it's output okay it's going in did i yeah That's going in. Okay, how'd you get it? Oh, it's, oh, it's going in that side, but it's, it's making power. It's making, oh, oh my days, it's making power. It's making power. All right, let's put you down. Is that still going in? All right. Um, oh, fluid pipes are all out here. Oh, but it's producing power. It's producing power. I, your consumption, current production, 256, and it makes 256. We got two turbines. Oh, that is nice. How much does this make? I don't know. I don't know how how you read that. Um, one of the one of the things was um a fuel cell. Uh, emeralds. Okay, more stuff. Um, energy pipes. Nope. No one. Oh, it's the one that I missed out okay fuel cell
Okay, so... Auto input. And that is... I don't even... Okay. Auto input from this side. Yes. And it's going in. Oh, this is awesome. We have power. We have proper power. We have... You don't know how excited I am. We have proper power. Right. Oh, this is brilliant. Okay, so now I've got it all working. I mean, it's an absolutely freaky thing, but we've got it all working. And yeah, it's used up all the ethanol. I will, um, I will recon reconfigure and rejig and whatever. I'll have to take that down because we don't need that anymore. And yes, we've got it. We've, we've got it working. We have power. So now we can start looking at, um, we can, we can start looking at, this is, um, this should be empty, right? Yeah, that would be empty. So now we can start looking at, um, at hooking up all our machines and so on. So I'm going to rejig this so it looks a bit better. I think what I will do, the only thing is if I tear this down, if it's going to, re no, it's gone into the battery, so we're fine. So yeah, what I will do, I will tear this down, put the turbine over in this corner, so then it will just connect straight to the turbine and we will have power. So in the next episode, we can start looking at getting some of these machines. So, well, the next logical step is thermal energistics and getting the ME system. So that was going to be fun. So thanks very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.